to see you. How are you? Yo, come on, one time, y'all gotta let me hear it. One time, let me hear you say. Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come on, one time, let me say, flavor, flavor. Yo, I'm Flame on the Conan and show, baby. You're on yeah. the Conan show. Back yeah. with my boy. Back with my man. What's Martha up, baby? Martha Stewart did the same thing. <laughs> yeah. But she ain't doing as great as I did. That's true. I know that. Word well, up. What's up? <laughs> we're out of time. Thank you for being here. <laughs> No, we not. And we got some more time. Hey, yo, we clock. got some more time now. This is my Kelly Ripper clock, kid. Kelly. Okay. <laughs> Why is it your Kelly Ripper clock? Oh yeah, because she gave me this. You oh, know okay. when they. Oh, okay, that would make sense. Clay, uh, <laughs> first of all, I'm told you brought me a gift. What did you bring me? Did hey, yo, honestly, to tell you the truth, guess what I got for my dude? Watch with this, Conan. I now pronounce you down with the Flav Club. Oh. what? We're getting married. This is <laughs> Conan. Oh, look. Brand new grill, baby. Grill. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like a hillbilly rapper. <laughs> <laughs> Only thing I can say is we are the little Conan. That's incredible. Thank you so much. I'm gonna I'm gonna treasure this. Yo, no doubt, no doubt, man. You're welcome, man. Um, I have to ask you first of all, how'd you start wearing the clock? Because you talk about a lot of uh, great things in this book, but one thing you reveal is how the clock started, how this tradition started. Because well, it's a crazy idea. Well, honestly, back in the days, you know, Conan, you know, we used to wear stopwatches and everything, you right. know. So uh, one day. You know, we was playing the dozens in our hallway. So this crackhead came through, through the project. <laughs> yeah, selling these shower I love clocks. These stories. Yeah. <laughs> hey, but it's true though. So she came through selling these clocks, these shower clocks. So my man son of a he was like, yo, take the stopwatch off. He put the clock around my neck. Everybody fell out laughing. It started as a dare for me to wear this clock for the opening for the Beastie Boys in Passaic, New Jersey, back in 1986. I did it, and ever since then, here's your boy on right. Conan with the clock. You did it. You did it as a dare. Are you someone yeah. that will always accept the dare? Yeah, you do, you're dead right, man. I heard that, so... <laughs> I dare you to wear this cuckoo clock. <laughs> did you wear this cuckoo clock? You know the way your clock and it got a gold chain. Yeah, wow. I, mean, I think it, yeah. You, your crown's in the way. I forgot you well, were. Well, you know I'm the king. The king yes. of reinventing myself all the time. I got to do it. Yeah, well, why not wear a crown then? <laughs> That's right, baby. Hey, hey, I ain't gonna lie. Right in there. I see a couple of Hey, 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 it goes good with the soup. Yeah, it's very nice. <laughs> You talk about a lot of uh, very candid things in the book. You're quite honest. You talk about your relationship with uh, uh, Brigitte Nielsen. Wow, yeah. Okay. In fact, that's... Hey, 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 honestly, to tell you the truth, that's one of the strangest relationships I've ever been in with in my life. <laughs> wow. But it that's was real. Be... But it was real, though. I mean, you know what me and Bridget had going on. Yeah, was, it was it real or was it just for the cameras? No, nah, that was real, man. Because we really fell in love for a minute and all that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I said for a minute. How how really real was the relationship? I mean, how far did I mean, it... I mean, it was really real. But then, you know, we, I, I, we failed to realize, man, you know what I'm saying, that... You know, she lives in Italy. You know what I'm saying? I live here in America. Yeah. She has a family. She's there. there. You're here with a cuckoo yeah. clock and a crown. Yeah, that's right. With a cuckoo clock You're and a crown. Letting yeah. everybody know that I'm down. And I'm yeah. going to always be around. <laughs> and it works. Yeah, uh, but, but I, had fun. I had fun with her, though, man. You know what I'm saying? We did bring America Good Television, Conan. We did. <laughs> All right, there he goes. Yeah, you did. Yes, you did. <laughs> now, I, I, you want to get into movies now, is that right? You yeah. have an idea for a movie. Yeah, definitely. Right now, you know, i got a couple of partners, a man from Roosevelt, Long Island. Uh, you know, we wrote a couple of movies right now. One is called Macula. Now, check this out. It's a horror movie. You know what I'm saying? And what we did... It's a horror we, movie called Macula. Yeah, Macula. See, now, let me tell you where we got the name from. See, you know, you know, back in the days, there was Dracula. Yeah. Then there was the first all-black 
a vampire movie called Blackula. Mm -hmm. So we took Blackula, and then there was a movie called The Mac. You know what I'm saying? You know, <laughs> eh, 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 you know, like, like the Mac had all kinds of girls. You know, he was the Mac. Yeah. So being that I did the Flavor Love, you know, they call me the Black Hugh Hefner. Well, if I'm the Black Hugh Hefner, okay, well, Hugh Hefner is the white Flavor Flav. Hey! <laughs> but anyway... <laughs> but anyway... So we took the Mac... And we crossed it with Blackula, and that's how we came up with Macula. So, and this, and this movie so is he's like a, a cross. So he's a, is he a, he's a pimp? Yeah, he's a pimped out vampire. You know, you can't kill me. I'm not dying. No time soon. It's going to take about three or four sequels to kill you, man. You know, I got to stay on the two. You know what I'm saying? But then also it's a cross between a Night of Living Dead, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, we got all that going on. Decapitations, all that stuff going Why on. Why don't you dude. throw in a couple of other movies in Gone with the Wind? Why don't you just keep... <laughs> <laughs> just throw in any movie you can think of. Hey, yo, why don't you be in the movie, man? Come and be a zombie in the movie, G. I got a part of that. O'Brien, baby, the best that did it got away with it, my dude. <laughs> Y'all love coming on your show, What fam? just happened? <laughs> Flavor Flav, the icon, the memoir is in stores right now. Flavor Flav, That's right, God bro. bless you. Jeff Curtis Stone, coming up with another better right